Late one night when everyone was in bed, Kayla had a bad dream. What? Mommy? Daddy? What? Oh, 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 okay, Lou. I had a bad dream. Oh jeez. What did you dream? A nuclear bomb exploded outside our house. Bad dreams are pretty scary, I will admit. But it's over now. Do you feel better? Yes, Daddy. Good. Now go back to sleep. Yawn. Good night, Kalu. Good night, Daddy. Duh. Kayla saw a shape on the wall that looked like Barney the dinosaur. He didn't realize though that the shape was his own stuffed dinosaur Rixie. Oh, it's Rexy. Kayla now felt scared again, being alone in the dark. So he decided to go sleep in his mommy and daddy's bed. Daddy, wake up! Not again, Kalu. What now? I don't want to sleep in my room. I want to stay here. You can't sleep with us. You have to sleep in your own room like a normal boy. But I don't want to. Kalo, we all need sleep. Otherwise, we'll all be very tired and grouchy tomorrow like that What's New Scooby-Doo episode. Mommy, I need a drink of water. Oh, what the hell? I'll be right back. Kayla wanted Mommy to sleep with him, and he also got out a storybook for her to read to him to put his plan into action. Here's your water. Can you read me a bedtime story, Mommy? Oh, ha ha. Oh, no, Kalo. You already had a story before bed. One more, please. It's very late. You need to go to sleep. But I'm too freaked out. That's because you're also tired. It's easier to be scared at night when you're sleepy. Duh. Gilbert, what the fuck? <coughs> Mommy. Now what, Kalo? Gilbert spilled my water. Fine, I'll clean it up. There, now go back to sleep. Kalo was really trying to fall asleep. But he was too freaked out by his nightmare to go back to sleep. He felt restless. Kayla was sure he would feel better sleeping with his parents. Finally he fell asleep, but not for long. Help, a pervert. Oh. It's you, Kalu. I want to sleep with you. I don't like my room. Kalu, this bed can't fit all of us. Stop being such a coward and go back to sleep in your own bed. And besides, what about Gilbert, Rixie and Teddy? They'll be lonely and afraid without you. They can sleep here too. Nope, not allowed. Sleep in your own bed or you are grounded. Wait. I have to go diarrhea. Gilbert's glad you're back in bed. Now you can get some sleep. I don't want to sleep, Daddy. I'm not tired. Look outside, Kalu. What do you see? It's nighttime. I can see the moon. That's right. And all those house lights are out because everyone is in bed sleeping. So that means you have to go to bed as well.
Really? Yes. And don't think about nuclear wars or any shit like that before falling asleep. Instead, try and think about good things before you fall asleep so you'll dream about something good, maybe some of your favorite things. Like what? Don't toy with me, Kalu. You know what you like. List a few of them. Chuck E. Cheese's, go animate. Ha ha ha, those will work, moi. Now think of good things or else you'll have another nightmare and I will have to ground you. Kayla started to think about some of his favorite things, including his toy trucks. The problem was, it worked too well, and it made him want to play with his trucks instead of going to sleep. Vroom, vroom, beep, ah, gah. Oh shit. Kayla was worried his parents would be furious about the noise. Honey, go yell at that little brat, will you? Oh, 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 okay, no. How dare you set off sirens in the middle of the night? Kayla was so tired he was now upset, but he was still too freaked out to go to sleep. Kalo, you need some sleep to feel better. I'm too tired to ground you now anyway. But I might have another bad dream. Let me see your pillow. How come? Maybe if I flip it over, that will convince your brain to have good dreams. Gilbert's going to sleep, and Teddy is asleep, and Rexy is asleep, and yes, Kalo is asleep. Good night, Kalo, good dreams.